Hey guys, I'm Melanie and you're watching AKA Mommy. And I wanted to go ahead and share with you today my first grocery haul for the month of April 2017. Today is April 1st. I don't know for sure which day you'll be seeing this video, but I did want to put out there today is the official first day of April. And I went to Aldi today. Now, I may have already put up a video on my channel explaining kind of what's going on with us and our budget um, and our debt-free journey. If not, it will be coming very, very soon. Um, I'm just not sure which order the videos will be listed in. So, without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and share with you what I picked up today at Aldi. I will let you know that my grocery budget for this week was $100. Um, we do have food in our house, so I was kind of just filling in the gaps. And today at Aldi, I spent $63.07. So, I'm going to flip the camera around and show you what I picked up today. Okay guys, so we're just gonna go ahead and start over here. I did wanna uh, mention, if you shop at Aldi, make sure that you pick up um, the little flyer that they have by the door on your way out. It'll kind of give you an idea of what's going to be on sale for the next week. So later I will be looking at that. But let me get started here. I picked up some vanilla yogurt for my kiddos. They have really been enjoying that lately, so I got some of that. Two containers of sour cream. We have never purchased ice cream from Aldi before, but my husband is a huge ice cream fan and mint chocolate chip is one of his absolute favorites. And so I got this for him to try. Hopefully he will like it. I have two gallons of milk back here, as well as some coconut milk. I use this in my coffee or in my um, protein shakes. Um, two cans of biscuits. I picked up some mixed vegetables that I'll be using in a recipe. Two limes because I needed lime juice. And so I figured this was the best way to go there. I picked up some green onions also for a recipe. I like to try to have fruit on hand for my kids and so I just pick up what's on sale. Um, I picked up a small container of blueberries, some strawberries, and also some grapes. We do still have bananas here as well as some mandarin oranges so that will be more than enough fruit to get us through the week. Iceberg lettuce just for sandwiches, tacos, anything that we might need it for. I picked up some of these ready to cook tortillas. Um, I really like the, the tortillas that are you know you cook at home now i will say i've never tried this particular brand but i'm willing to try anything once so i picked up two packages of these and we will give those a shot i picked up a stuffing mix i'm going to be using this to make a recipe so i got that two boxes of cereal for the kiddos this week um basically all these version of Honey Nut Cheerios, and then also their version of what would be, I guess, Honey Bunches of Oats. So both of those for my kids, they will have that as well as eggs or toast, waffles, oatmeal, that sort of thing for breakfast. So two boxes will definitely last us a week. Some onion soup mix, obviously for recipes. I picked up two packages of brown gravy mix and one Italian salad dressing mix. I also am completely out of Italian seasoning and the seasonings at Aldi are really reasonably priced, so I picked up that from there. I needed to get some stevia, and so I picked up this. Um, I'm not 100% sure how, how I will like it, but again, I'll try anything one time. Okay, so the next thing is some whole pepperoncini peppers. Um, I got these to use, again, in a recipe. Some tomato soup, um, some chili. My family is going to have chili dogs one night, and so I just needed some chili with no beans for that. Two loaves of bread. Um, these are less than a dollar a loaf. I can't remember the exact price, but they're really inexpensive. Um, but I can almost guarantee you that these are going to have high fructose corn syrup in them now that I'm thinking about it. Oh, there is none. Look at that, you guys. That's awesome. It actually is sweetened with real sugar. I love that. Okay, so that I'm happy with. Um, potatoes onions, a son over there who's hot and sweaty. You want to say hi? Hey. Hi. I picked up some spring mix, some organic spring mix, and this container was a little over $3. I want to say it was about $3.29 or so. Um, so that's a pretty good price. That's not bad at all. Two packages of ground turkey, one there and one there. And then the last thing is some ground beef. Now, I really wanted to watch my budget today and not spend excessively, but I only needed one pound of ground beef. And every other container that they had of the other, the, the less expensive ground beef was in like two or five pound containers. And so it actually was cheaper just to get this one because I literally only need one pound of it. So I went ahead and got 
the oh, an organic grass-fed ground beef um, and I feel okay about that. So that is everything that I picked up at Aldi. Let me go ahead and scan and make sure I have everything here that I can show you guys and yeah, that's everything for today. Right, guys, so that's gonna be it for this grocery haul. I hope that you have enjoyed seeing what I picked up for my family this week at Aldi. I will let you know, um, I am going to be doing our weekly shopping at Aldi for a considerable amount of time because it never ceases to amaze me how much money I can save in that store. It is just, it blows my mind. Eventually, I'm thinking about maybe doing a comparison video where I pick up certain things at Aldi and then certain things at Walmart and really look at the prices. But I need to hold off on that until I have a little bit more free time. So that's gonna be it. If you guys have enjoyed this video, make sure that you give it a thumbs up. That way I'll know that you want to continue seeing more grocery haul videos. They're definitely one of the more popular videos here on my channel. And if you guys missed my most recent video, you can check that out. A little link will pop up right over here on the screen. And if you are not already subscribed and you would like to be, then you can click on this link right here. Until next time, you guys, I hope that you're all doing very well and that you're very blessed. Take care. Bye.